But then, all good things. All good things. Mmm, yes. It was the summer of 2008. <laughs> <laughs> Pete Nadel announced well, he was getting married. Yeah, well, and, and really the start of it was I moved from having a job to having a career. I was selling two houses, buying a new one, getting married, yeah. starting life. I, I want to say that I would never have left Jason high and dry if I thought it was just going to be sending him on to do the show on his own and, and worry about it. And we had never even talked to Jim about it. No. About taking over as a host. And Nobody. You, know, you were very apprehensive about doing it. Like I felt like there was an all-star sitting on our bench. And I was happy to say, okay, if I'm going to step back, Somebody who's going to slide into my spot is going to be, admittedly now, better than what I was <laughs> because the energy and the passion that Jim puts into it, it was able to bring things to a different level. For you know, almost two years or a year and a half or whatever it was, um, I was used to just looking across the yeah. table at you and we could cue each other and you know different things. But had I not had that year and a half with somebody across from me, I never would have made the, been able to make the leap with somebody, you know, thousands of miles away yeah. or hundreds of miles away. Right. I, I wanted the show to continue, mm. and I wanted to continue listening to the show. Sure. I lost my favorite form of entertainment at that point yeah. because mm -hmm. I didn't have my favorite podcast anymore. Pete was gone, and those were big shoes to fill. There were two phone conversations we had where I tried to convince you to stay. <laughs> Okay. We did have those. And I want people to know that <laughs> yeah. in case there's still people out there thinking, I forced you out. He did a sign <laughs> yeah. off. And then the next week, there was the show. And, you know, Jason did say, join us next week. Our new co-host will be Jimmy Mack. And right. we just, let's just see how it works. And then there was always a bring back Pete, bring back Pete course that went on for like a year. And Pete, I love you, man. But... Sometimes it would just kind of get to me a little bit. <laughs> I'm like, man, I am putting my heart and soul into this thing every week. Well, and, and the funny thing is that I would hear the show, and, and after I would get done listening, go, it's better. <laughs> oh. it, it's better. Because it was. It, it was. I mean, there was but so you, you were much missed. more. You were missed. So I, and, much. I, and I missed it.